The Ohio Bobcats kicked off their nine-game homestead here at Bob Rand Stadium with a 6-0 win over Eastern Kentucky. Just a few weeks ago, starting pitching was really hurting the Bobcats. Coach Smith switched his game plan around and started alternating pitchers almost every inning, and that strategy worked wonders on Tuesday night. Smith's six pitchers pitched nine shutout frames en route to shutting out Eastern Kentucky. Ohio got on the scoreboard in the bottom of the third inning. Manny DeJesus hit a double to left field, bringing home David Hamlet. Manny's got a little streak going for himself right now after that hit, leading the team with seven consecutive games with a hit. Mitch Longo then brought DeJesus home one out later on an RBI ground out. Fast forward to the fifth inning here with two men on base. Manny's on second after a wild pitch, and Mitch is on first after being hit by a pitch. So two on, two out, all eyes on Jake Madsen, and uh, see you later. Hey, Madsen knows it's good. A three-run blast over the right field wall to increase Ohio's lead to five. He's now five hits away from becoming Ohio's all-time leader. Ohio added an insurance run in the seventh inning, and the rest was history. Coach Smith touched on how proud he was of his team after the game. Team win. Yeah, played good defense, um, pitched well, pitched extremely well, and got timely hitting. You know, big one, obviously, from from Jake Matson with the three-run homer, so it was just an all-around good team win. The Ohio Bobcats will return right back here tomorrow evening as they take on the University of Rio Grande in a non-conference matchup. Reporting for WOUB Sports, I'm Nathan Wiseman.